Found some. Get in the boat, boy. Don't want me to tie it to the boat? change. The forest feels different. Everything is different, boy. Try not to dwell on it. Yes, sir. That was the last. Where do I see my mother? Oh, there do I see my father. Oh, there do they call to me. Oh, there do they call to me. Do they call to me? Oh, there do they call to me? Oh, there do they call to me? Oh. 
She's ready. Sorry. Squeeze. This knife. It was hers. Now it is yours. Stort is hunt. She knew. Shall we? Now? Now. What are we hunting? You are hunting deer. Which way? In the direction of deer. Okay. Uh... This way. What did you find? Tracks. Not deer, though. I'll keep looking. Oh! Now what? This way, boy. Hup. Oh. There it is! Hold! What are you doing? Now its guard is up. Only fire. Only fire. When I tell you to fire. I'm sorry. Do not be sorry. Be better. Find it. Find it. temple but mom told me never to go in there we do what we please boy no excuses can I have my bow back now can you hit it from here We should get closer. What? He can no longer use it. We can. Look. Wait for my mark. Relax. Do not think of it as an animal. It is simply a target. Clear your mind. Steady your aim and breathe in. Feet solid. Steady yourself. 
Exhale and release. I got it. Good. Your knife. No. Finish what you started. I can't. Boy, boy, look at me. We did it. You are not ready. What? Are you serious? I found the deer. I proved myself. How am I not ready? We are going home. I haven't been sick in a long time. I can do this. You are not ready. Inside, boy. You lost control. That thing was trying to kill us. It's not like you don't get anger in a fight. Anger can be a weapon. If you control it, use it. You clearly cannot. When you... I haven't been sick in a long time. I'm better now. Fine. Come on, then. You want me to hit you? I want you to try. Try again. 
again. Why are you doing that? Too slow. Try again. Cut it out! Weak. Again. Again! Stop it! Again! <coughs> Your anger. You can get lost in it. The battle ahead is difficult. And you, Atreus, are clearly not ready. Who was that? Quiet. Come on out! There's no use hiding anymore. I know who you are. What's going on? Do you know him? More importantly, I know what you are. Boy, beneath the floor. Now. But you told me never to go down there. Who is that? I do not know. What's he talking about? I do not know. Get in. Just tell me what I want to know. No need for this to get bloody. Be bigger, but you're definitely the one. Long way from home, aren't you? What do you want? Oh, you already know the answer to that. Whatever it is you seek, I do not have it. You should move on. <laughs> and here I thought your kind was supposed to be so enlightened, so much better than us, so much smarter, and yet you hide out here in the woods, like a coward. You do not want this fight. Oh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I do. Try again. You talk too much. You won't talk? Fine. 
Maybe whoever it is you got stashed in that house will. <sighs> is pointless. It didn't have to be this way. Pathetic! You can't win! I feel nothing! But you, you feel everything, yet you, you keep trying! I'm not my brother, and if you'd given me what I wanted, it wouldn't have ended this way. But no! Let's finish this. <laughs> Without you, 
but we cannot stay here. so much I, I thought you're all right I am all right come <sighs> gather your things we are leaving thought I wasn't ready you are not we have no choice now Prove me wrong. Yes, sir. The mountain. It's going to be a long trip. Yes, but an important one. Oh. You've had to kill people before, haven't you? You're used to it. We do what we must to survive. Animals I get. They're food. Draugr, they're supposed to be dead. But people, they're trying to survive too. Look, all this time, there's been a protection stave around our entire woods. But the stave's broken there. Did you cut those down? She hand marked the tree she wished used for her pyre. Why'd she do that? Come. No looking back now. So, how long will it take to get to the mountain? I do not know. Before winter falls? I do Move. Thanks. There's the mountain! Let's go! Not yet! It's fine! See? Hang on! Hey! I'm slipping! Stay calm! Almost there! That wasn't so bad. Slow down. Your haste will cost us. Sorry. Mm. Ugh, more drawler. But these aren't moving. Are they dead? I mean, more dead? Boy. Not dead, not dead! Oh, what's that smell? Now! Are they Hellwalkers? They're untouched. Look! Someone start the fires! Sigmund, you're nice! So many days without meat. Meat? <clears throat> Wait, us? Behind me. What if they change like the others? We'll have to keep them alive. Strip off their meat. A little at a time. This fight is mine alone. <clears throat> ah! Boy!
Close your heart to it. Come then. We have a long journey. Wait here. I will handle this. Go drop the chain. Okay. Smart or something, boy. You're a boy, aren't you? Ha! Does she have a name? I don't know. Rude bastard ain't ever ask mine, so I ain't ever ask hers. Ah! Ha! What's yours? Brock. Better look at. Say, uh. You're not gonna believe me, but that axe you got, uh, it was me what made her. Me and my brother was one of our best. So don't let nobody else go work on her except for us two. Ah! You gotta handle her special, or she'll wreck beyond fixing. I can enhance her for you right now if it so pleases you, son of a bitch. So what say you? Ah! You are right. I do not believe you. Come, boy. There's a rune in the shape of a fork under the grip. No, digger beat ya, Doomber. That was our brand, my brother and me, before we split. I got half of it right here, see? Look, you want I should upgrade her or not? Very well. I expect an improvement. So, where's the other half of the brand? Oh, my dumb brother's got it. But I got all the talent. Look! this close to the mountain before. Looks so big. I wish Mom was here to see it. tracks hmm a boar maybe not sure but i'll find it but i hit it didn't i i did what you said and it looked like it bounced off could the boar be magical hmm. what do you think it looked weirder than any boar i've ever seen get after it then ran under Steady hand. Relax. Accuracy over speed. Yes! Well, do not lose it. Doesn't. He's my friend. The boy was following my command. Then help fix this. Hold here, please. 
Hold, I said. He's losing blood. The last of his kind in all the realm, and you shoot him. You needed food? Target practice. Target practice. I'm... I'm so, so sorry. Keep that pressure on. The blame is mine. I should have kept a closer eye. Will he die? I will not let him. You. The arrow cut a tideway inside him. Find both ends and hold them tightly. Start with the left side. Grab it and hold. Now the right side. Hold it tight. Good. Now pull them together. Line them up. So now... Fuck. You're a witch. I can't finish the healing here. My home is just beyond the trees there. You will carry him. He must not die. Good. He seems stable and calm for now. Graytha. This way. That bow is a little big for you, isn't it? My mother made it for me. Said I'd go into it. I've never seen you in these woods. She must miss you being away from home. She... She's dead. We're taking her ashes to the highest peak in the realms. Ashes? It was her last wish. Boy. I'm... Sorry for your loss. We're here. You live in a tree? Not in it. Below it. Hemelay! Look! Is he friendly? Boy. I promise you, he's safe. <laughs> on the stave there. Keep him still. You live alone? It's better this way. Yeah, my father doesn't like people either. Boy. Well, you don't. Hold him still before he hurts himself. Good. Shh. Easy. Rest now. I need two more things. Fresh red root grows just behind the house. Can you pull a cluster? What else? I... I know you're a god. Not of this realm, but there's no mistaking it. He doesn't know, does he? About your true nature? Or his own? That is none of your concern. The gods of these realms don't take kindly to outsiders, trust me. I know. When they find you, and they will, they'll make things difficult. The boy will want answers. And that will be my problem. Whatever you're hiding, you cannot protect him forever. But you're right. Doesn't concern me. I also need lamb's crest. Do you mind? A white petal flower in my garden? Just a handful. Fine. Lamb's Chris.
Would this help? I dropped it? When you were chasing the animal. What's wrong with me? If I... If I lost it, then... You did lose it. I'll take better care of it from now on. Without thanks. You want solitude? This mark will hide you from those who might make your journey difficult. that leads safely out of these woods. Follow this path down, then head towards daylight. Will we see you again? As much or as little as you like. Now get out of here. Oh boy. Can't quite make it out. It reads Sacrifice your arms to the center of the water. Awaken again the cradle of the world. What? Throw our weapons into the water? Guess that won't be a problem for you. Are you gonna do it? Way over there. See that? And there's a statue of Thor. Except 
I can see a lot more of him now. The water dropped, and the serpent rose. Oh, that must be why the beach wasn't there before, see? And there's the mountain. Look it, that building leads from the foot of the mountain to that golden temple. It was all just under the surface. Except for the statue. Good thing, huh? There's even a dock. There, next to the flag. Is this the way to the mountain? It would seem. If it isn't the bearded beaver, it is sexy. Have I got something for you, too? Brock? But how did you... None of your fucking business. Now get in here, I got something for you. And don't go making pig eyes at my spot. I saw it first. Okay. What do you think he wants? To test our patience. When word gets out about my new shop, folks will finally come out of high Itch! The pile of rocks there, with that key of Yggdrasil, you can open a magic door to the branches of the world tree. A shortcut between the realms. If you ever see a mountain in the world, use it to get back to me quick. But it's only one way. Straight back here and nowhere else. And whatever you do... Whoa. Sure is foggy here. Another dwarf. Should we... No. He is of no consequence. Uh, excuse me, but, um... How did you come by that, uh, axe? That is my concern alone. And, uh, while I won't dispute that, I, I know that blade. It was one of ours, but, uh... <laughs> we didn't make it for you. Step aside. I can't. See, the woman we made it for, I was, uh, well, I am quite fond of her, and I would be somewhat displeased if it turns out that you did something to her. It was my mother's. She left its father before she died. Face dead? I'm very, very sorry to hear that. She was a fierce warrior. And a good woman. Okay. I will make improvements to the axe. But nobody asked you to. Well, it's, it's true, but... But knowing your mother, <laughs> she would have insisted I repair that act of vandalism perpetrated against her axe by my brother. I knew it. You are Brock's brother. The other half of the brand's here. The blue one is your brother. Yes. Though my talents are vastly superior. <laughs> no boast. I swear to Freya. <gasps> Do not undo his work. Improve upon it only. Yeah. But can you... can you put it down over there? That handle is... No. Uh, filthy. Okay, then. I'll just... I will just... Oh. 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 Oh, is that dried blood? Oh. So, what were you working on? Oh, that. I call it the Sky Mover. Just up that mountain waits a treasure trove of rare resources. Once I mine it, I'll need a way to bring it all down. And you know how to fix it? No.
back, boy. Ugh. What is that? We must find another way up. The witch! Wish she was here. Bet she could get us past this. My magic is useless against the Black Breath, and there's no way around it. Odin saw to that long ago. What are you doing here? Making sure you can finish your journey. Why wait to warn us? I was busy, saving my friend, if you remember. The Black Breath is a corruption of magic even I can't dispel. Only the pure light of Alfheim is strong enough to break through. But that road is long. What does this goal mean to you? It's everything. Follow me. Why help us? Maybe I see more of myself in you than I'm willing to admit. Maybe... Maybe by helping you, I'll make up for a lifetime of mistakes. Or maybe I just like you. Even though we shot your friend? Even though you shot my friend, yes. Where must we go? To a realm beyond your own. Tyr's temple is at the center of the lake. It is from there we travel to Alfheim. Thankfully, it's no longer underwater. Why is that creature in the bay? No one knows. He just appeared one day. Soon after, Thor attacked, and their battle could be felt across all the realms. Ultimately, it ended in a stalemate, and Thor returned to Odin empty-handed. The serpent stayed and grew so large, he now spans all of Midgard. See? Told you. They've hated each other ever since. Destined to kill each other come Ragnarok. You believe in Ragnarok? I dearly wish I didn't, child. Watch your step. Just along here. Are you sure? We came through here before, and there's no way back to talk. See? Now push it back into place. Now realign the wheel onto the track. Perfect. Now push the bridge along the track. What? The whole entire bridge is turning. How is the whole entire bridge turning? Boy, you're really strong. Just keep pushing until the bridge reaches its first position. Tired yet? No. He's always been really strong. So about the dead. We heard someone call them Hellwalkers. But what are they? They are poor, restless souls denied their judgment and their peace. By what? Did Vanir magic raise the dead? It could, once, but this is no spell. This plague of dead is but a symptom of a world out of balance. Something or someone has meddled with powerful forces. That is all I know for sure. Leosa. Your bowstring stopped glowing. Its power is now depleted. Only a few knocks of magic remained in the bowstring and we used them. Your bow, please. Once you claim the light of all time, infuse the bowstring with its power. Don't forget. You talk like you're not coming with us. I'll try, but measures were taken to keep me trapped in Midgard. Why? The gods don't care for me much. Is this it? It's so dark. This temple has been asleep, underwater for almost 150 winters. It needs only the light of the Bifrost to reawaken. Those roots don't look like your magic. They aren't. 
These roots are part of the Great World Tree, and make travel between the realms possible. How does it work? You will need this, a Bifrost, to create travel between realms. It can capture, hold, and transfer the light of Alfheim. Place the Bifrost there. What now? Give it a moment. The temple needs time to wake up from its long slumber. It is from this room, and this room alone, that you will be able to cross between realms. What you see before you represents the temple in which we stand, as well as the realm towers that encircle the Lake of Nine outside. All the realms exist in the same physical space, reflections of each other. These doors, the towers outside, and the Nine Realms are all intertwined and coexisting on the branches of the World Tree, separated only by the Bifrost Light of Alfheim. This place can focus and control that light. And is this the World Tree? Only an artistic representation of it. No, the Yggdrasil is much, much more than this. The Tree of Life is bound to the fate of the world, just as we are bound to it. The tree nourishes our soils. The dew from its leaves feeds our valleys and rivers. The tree's very existence supports all of creation along its boughs. Its life energy interwoven into the tapestry of life. Birth, growth, death, and rebirth. Every strand transcending time, transcending space. Everything comes back to the tree. So, that's how it works. But I'm guessing you were looking for a more practical answer. Yeah. Welcome to Alfheim, gentlemen. Think you can spot... The light. I can barely see it. Something's wrong. See that column of light on the horizon? It's housed in the heart of a ring temple. We'll find what we need there. No. No, no, no. Damn it, not yet. What's happening? <sighs> to restore the Bifrost magic, you must step into the light. But be very careful not to get caught. She's not dead. Is she? Not likely. Come. Huh? Again, I said nothing. Wait, this one you said something. What is it, boy? Oh. Voices. You don't hear that? I hear nothing. It's going away now. It was screaming. Lots of voices. Angry. You really didn't hear that? No. It felt... evil. Hello? I don't get it. Why even have a door then? 
Hello? Look. Another light up. What's he doing? Oh no! Why are they killing him? He didn't do anything. Do not assume. You are seeing the end of a war, boy. You do not know what led to this moment. But he didn't even defend himself. That was his choice. You are more concerned with our safety than our goal. Quiet! I have him. Your knife, boy. That was close. Do not stray from me, boy. You don't gotta tell me. Stay back. Are you injured? I'm fine. Wow. It's beautiful. The light. It's making the whole temple reappear. It's the source of all of it. Wait. It's... It's singing. I hear... I hear her! I told you I heard her! Do you think she's in there? Ah! Ah! Ugh. That really hurt. I felt like my hand was on fire. Stay here. But I want to Stay... Go. here. We use it as a last resort. You're giving me your axe? I'm letting you hold my axe. It is not a gift. Still. thinks I am. I know better. He doesn't talk to me. 
doesn't teach me. It should have been him. Do you hear me? Him, not you. Except, I don't mean that. You know I love him. I just wish he was better. I know he can be. So if he tries, I'll try. But if he doesn't, please come back. I know you're out there somewhere. Only... Moments. No! You've been gone a long, <coughs> long time. I didn't know what to do. You left me here again. <coughs> Why don't you care? I... That's impossible. We should go before they come back. I hope you got what you needed. Yes. Look! There's our exit. But there's no light to make a bridge. We're trapped. And the witch's bowstring is huge. You wouldn't even care if she was. Mind your tongue, boy! Until our journey is over, one of us must remain focused. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. Mourn how you wish. Leave me to my own. I'm sorry. I didn't realize. No. Why would you? I do not know my ways. I know it has not been easy. In the light, I felt only moments pass. If that is of some comfort to you. I think I see how this works. The claws on one side. And if we get this unstuck... Oh no! I think the rope stuck under that rock. That was careless. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Hmm. Something feels strange up there. We're heading into danger. Do not concern yourself with what might be. Focus on what is, and be vigilant. Yes, sir. Not the top. Caught we'll closer. Wait! That one's not broken! 
There's a note. A giant's prayer. They're asking their ancestors to watch over them. To guide them home. Boy. Wait. I think I know how it works. Watch. Ask them to watch your mother. Do you think they'll watch over us on the way to the top? Come, boy. It is a long way up. Comes next. We go home. That's it? The adventure is over? For now. But we will have much to do. You were right earlier, on the boat after cutting down the last tree. You said it felt like something had changed. And it has. And our home is no longer safe. But it will be again. And we must continue your training. Okay. Kill something that big? If we can catch it off balance. I can distract him. What are you doing? We have to help him. Break right. Find an angle. Wait for my mark. Thank you. crane on my mark. did it. And you! Ah! Uh, but, 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 nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years! Not since the grand culling of the worms. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me! You are mistaken. 
The dragon was simply in our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me, and that deserves compensation. What are these? Braided mistletoe arrows. Straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Oh. Uh, thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh, ooh, not that. Um, have you seen my brother again? Yeah, he said you lost your talent. <laughs> oh, and that I'm selfish. No, I'm sure. That I value a weapon's look. No, over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No, and uptight. Fussy. I know what he thinks, but he can't hurt me any... Ah! Burn that. I do not have time for this. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I have a better idea. What? I just need a tooth from that dragon. Yeah. I am not touching that. Just hold it out. <laughs> now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Two passes should do it. Ah, gently, now. Look! The summit! We're so close now! Your quiver. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. A broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good? Good. Go. You know why we're here. last you managed to loosen your tongue. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. He's not company this time. It must be important if our sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me, you two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You were the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions. Take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? Ah, the very topic of conversation. A tattooed man traveling with a child. Boy, took their path. Make sure we're alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. And I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. But Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. Promise. Just given time. Nobody there, just like I said. 
The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard. It's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! That could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? And Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body from these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This... This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Brother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy, the longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. So you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Fair enough. Hear me screeching at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. Leave him, boy. No, Fab. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. We are not hungry. Good. It's not what I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you let him go and Roger my axe good and plenty again. Hmm? Let's see the damage. Mm, little canker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. Mm. Is he eating well enough? I guess. Good. All better. Now what the fuck else you want, huh? Da Father, she is here! It is so good to see you again! I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello? Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what... Wait, where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me! 
Now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. <sighs> now, what's this about a head? <sighs> Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? Take him to the table. Hey, Mila. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well, thankfully his head hasn't decayed much and his brain is still intact. Nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now, hold his head under the water and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. It worked! Let me see him. Mamir, you there? Yes. Good. Oh. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. <sighs> Had I known the witch in the woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either? Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once, yes. But no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? We are leaving, boy. But... Now. You're welcome. That statue made in honor of Thor. And seeing as the world serpent absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? No. Our only concern is your name. All right, wish me luck. Uh, ooh. Ha, ha, ha. You envy me. I've still got it, lads. You remembers me. Why are you? the pain of your loss. He will help you. Uh. 
direction. Listen closely now. We need two things to get us into the land of the giants. First, we need to learn the travel rune that opens realm travel to Jotunheim. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. Is that one of the peak where we first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Luckily, I know where it is. And it's not far. He looks kind of mad for a moment there. Ready. Dig in and push with everything. Yes, sir. How do we get down? We jump. Really? Come. Brother, we may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Uh oh, yeah. Boy, surrender. The old father demands it. No. This fight is mine, boy. Go! And where do you think you're going? Oh no, brother! The little freak's got a bow! What are we gonna do? <laughs> well, Mother must have been some whore to make the last of him. I'll kill you! The boy's sick. He needs Freya. No! Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? Atreus. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway right there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods. Some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry. Not oh. that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. It smells like... Rain? You ruined everything! I earned that 
fucking hammer. But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it. Cause Magni's gone. It'll be a joke. But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me. Now your father's doing. Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! You don't know anything about my mother. Oh, it's true. But I'm gonna get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother. Right after I finish killing your father! Whoops! I think I broke him! <laughs> oh, no! Stay back! The boy. Atreus. You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Freya's forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's her. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god. But a god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. Just called the serpent. I'm still a god. Go away. The boy has fallen ill. Freya! He is ill. Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. Ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm -hmm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your Frost Axe will be useless. 
You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Himmel. Hey, you must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart. And your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise.
There's nowhere you can hide, Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> you cannot change. You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. the heart, brother. You'll have to get your hands dirty. Just set. Try not to linger here, though, eh? Kratos. Zeus. Zeus? My father. Your father was Zeus? Well, that explains a lot. What is that place? Never go there. Understand? Is he here? That is not possible. It's just an. Psst. Yeah. Shh. He ain't supposed to be here. It's cold. Real quick, give me your blades. Why? Yeah, I said I'd help you, and I aim to. Come on. Oh, my equipment's in Midgard. Be right back. Yeah. You don't suppose he nicked those, do you? Yeah. Now they're ready for the winds of hell. Just target this magical glowy bit here with your blades and throw! Not now. We should focus on getting out of hell. And with that, I cannot argue. I'll just contemplate that little nugget in silence then. Your father was Zeus? I finally understand! I'm dangling from the hip of the bloody ghost of Sparta! Do not call me that. Oh, don't mistake me, brother. From what I heard, the Pantheon had it coming. It's still a bit to take in. I knew you hate gods, but you really can't stay away from them, can you? You must say nothing to the boy. He must never know. Bollocks, brother. Respectfully, bollocks. He has to know. He'll never be whole without the truth. Look, I get it. You hate the gods. All gods. It's no accident that includes yourself. And it includes your boy. 
You see that? You have it. Yes. Back of your hand. He is still ill. I can break the fever, but to heal... He must know the truth of what he is. Yes. It is not so simple. Help me prop him up. Did I tell you that I have a son, too? It's been... forever since I last saw him. At his birth, the runes foretold a needless death. Babe in my arms was so small, so helpless. I knew right then I would do anything to protect him, no matter the sacrifice. Of course, everything I did, I did for myself. I let my needs, my fears, come before what he needed. And I couldn't see his resentment until it was too late. Don't make the same mistake. Have faith in him. I know the truth isn't simple. But nothing is when it involves your child. It is a curse. The boy has been cursed. I will not. I'm better now. I see that. Is he well enough to travel? For now. They won't happen again. I promise. You see that it does not. Get in. I will pull. Quiet. Are you not better? I guess. I know you overheard my talk with Freya. You think you understand, but you do not. Why do you say nothing? You said I was cursed. You think I'm weak because I'm not like you. I know I was never what you wanted. After all this, I thought... Maybe things were different. You do not know everything, boy. No. But at least I know the truth now. The truth? The truth? I'm a god, boy. From another land far from here. When I came to these shores, I chose to live as a man. But the truth is, I was born a god, and so were you. Boy, have you nothing to say? Um. Can I turn into an animal? Can you turn into an animal? No. 
No, I do not think so. I'm a god. Mother knew? She was a god too? No. She was mortal, but she knew my true nature. I'm a god. Why did you wait so long to tell me? I had hoped to spare you. Being a god, it can be a lifetime of anguish and tragedy. That is the curse. What sorts of things can I do? Can I fly? Or turn invisible? I don't feel like God. I do not know the reach of your godhood. But over time, you will learn. You sure I can't turn into a wolf? You are welcome to surprise me. Is this why I hear voices sometimes? Are you sure you've never heard any? Not as you do. That's no surprise. Every god is unique. So, maybe I won't get strong like father, but I'll have abilities all my own? You already do, laddie. Your faculty for language is extraordinary for one so young. Time alone will tell what else you'll become capable of. So you knew all along? I did, lad. But I've known more than my share of gods. Me too, apparently. I wonder who else knew I was a god. Freya, for sure. Barak and Sindri? They do not need to know. <gasps> Balder! Does he know? Is that why he's after us? Do you know him from before? The day of your mother's funeral was the first I ever saw Balder. That is the truth. Hey, we don't have to go right back to Chair's vault, do we? I mean, we're God. We can do whatever we want, right? What do you really feel like doing right now? I will show you. Let's try this again. <clears throat> forget why we are here. Okay. Chases the sun. For Ragnarok to happen, they have to eat them. But these are out of order. Good boy. So the moon goes on the left, sun on the right. With Midgard in the middle, but which bar do I pull? 
That's something. Metals from my home and from this land. One for myself. And when you were ready, one for you. Today is that day. So I'm a man now. Like you? No. We are not men. We are more than that. The responsibility is far greater. You will be better. The power of this weapon, any weapon, comes from here. But only when tempered by this, by the discipline, the self-control of the one who wields it. That is where the true strength of a warrior lies. You must never forget that. Good then. Come. close to the end.
to a journey's end. Really? It smells like rotten eggs. Is it still good? Possibly. Father, why did you leave your home and come here? Does it have to do with the other gods there? <laughs> it's just, you hate the gods so much. But Tyr proves that gods can be good. And you're good. You only killed those deserving, right? Yes. Ah. Uh. But who's worthy enough to judge? Quiet, Head. We are. We know better. Huh? Sounding more like your da by the moment. Ready. Ready. Come. I think I'm gonna like being a god. Excited to finally see the land of the giants? Yeah, but also sad the journey's almost over. Oh, what if we get to Jotunheim and there aren't any giants there either? Makes little difference to us. Fulfilling your mother's wish is what is important. Ah! Oh, don't go anywhere. Be with you in two shakes. Father, can I tell him? No. Tell me what? Did you put this wheel in your mouth? Oh, God. I I'll vomit. I I'm not kidding. I'll throw up on it. It is nothing. A family matter. Oh. Uh, uh, oh. I can tell you a thing or two about family matters. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Let me guess. Your brother isn't as talented as you, and his work is junk. Um, those things are accurate. Your point? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Do something about it or shut up already. I see. Yeah! We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems! Um... All right. That hurt a little. Let's have a look at your gear, then. did more than that. Move it, or we'll pick up where he left off. I'll kill you. No. He is beaten. Not worth killing. He should pay for what he said about Mother. I said no. But we're gods. We can do whatever we want. <laughs> That's what I said to your mother right before I gave it to her. What are you doing? This is a much better knife than mother's. <laughs> You 
lost control. Haven't you been teaching me to kill? I have been teaching you to survive. We are gods, boy. And that makes us a target. From now until the end of days, you are marked. So I teach you to kill, yes. But in defense of yourself. Never as an indulgence. Nobody cared about him anyways. What's the difference? There are consequences to killing a god! Why? How do you know? How do you know? Watch your tone, boy. Whatever. Beautiful, isn't it? Why I remember once. Brother, look out! Miss me. Run, boy! Cross the bridge! No! I'm a god too! I can do this! Get off him! Really? Walter, let him go. Take me instead. I'll do whatever you Shut up. up. All this time, I thought I needed you. But you're just me. Turns out, the boy is the brains. do all the heavy lifting for you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let go! Calm down, boy. You are not ready for this. I am oh! ready. <laughs> and here I thought my family was fucked up. <laughs> Your father is right, boy. You are far from ready. Now, would you be so kind as to hold this for me? Thank you. Atreus! Yeah. 
the bridge! Hey! I asked you a question! <laughs> and when the bridge opens, the full weight of Ascot will come crashing down on you. <laughs> it's over. Is it? So be it. Kill them, you know I will. What did you do? Not speak a word. I am your father, and you, boy, are not yourself. You are too quick to temper. You are rash, insubordinate, and out of control. This will not stand. You will honor your mother and abandon this path you have chosen. It is not too late. This discussion is far from over. We are here because of you, boy. Never forget that. No, I would never stay out of sight. Listen, you, you have no right. I have every right. I am your mother. Red. Take it away, Mom. I can't. Please. Please. Please take it away. It doesn't work like that. Son. Trust me in time. You will be free. me. Freya is his mother. What you Why did you keep me? this from us, Head? Would you believe it slipped my mind? I would not. Uh, I'm at a loss. I assure you have no reason to keep such a thing a secret. There's the boat. We will speak more of them.
is Odin's. I'd recognize his atrocious taste anyway. Look at that! It's the missing panel about here. Odin must have stolen it. But why? He always has his reasons. Might I have a look? Well, this is most unexpected. Why? What does it mean? I haven't the foggiest. Isn't that unexpected? Good. Look, clearly that's Tyr. Traveling somehow. Perhaps magically. But what's that to do with the giants that they should devote a shrine to it? I'm afraid that is none too clear. What are those runes in the corners? Not runes. Symbols from different lands. They mean... War. Aye. How do you... This one I know too well. Oh. His eyes. They are jewels. Like yours. No doubt signifying the gift of sight the giants granted us. Give me a closer look. Interesting. Very interesting. What is that? Secret plans concealed by Tyr so none could access but him. And those few others the giants trusted. And right under Odin's nose, ho ho ho! I did promise I'd get you to Jotunheim. What do you mean, Ed? You said we were out of options. Don't you see, brother? Odin never gave up hope, and neither should we. He knew there was a clue in here, but we're the ones who found it. These plans are for a key to some chamber tears kept hidden. I don't know where it's leading or what we'll find, but it's a path. How do we make this key? I suggest we ask a dwarf. That symbol on the temple door. It's a bunch of rooms together. Peace, unity, hope. Boy. Before, when you saw. I didn't see anything. You did not see me with someone. An old man. What old man? Yes. Very well. Can you make it? Is it a weapon? Armor? Or likewise an instrument of war of which I'm a master at shaping? No? Then forget it. Even if I wanted to make such an insignificant goo -gaw, I'm liable to chink my tools working on something so Delicate and ladylike. Then shingle it. Pattern weld the item with scap slag. Keep the layers thin. Alternate the overlay. Okay, smart guy. And where do you propose to find a lump of quality scap slag? Last time I saw one, I could still get rigid down south. Shut your mouth. Is that... Where did you... I had to get my hands dirty. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't just stand there. Let's do this. What? You? You're fine with working on something that's not a weapon? Oh, hell, why not? <laughs> what? I can grow too. Oh, what? Watch the spine. Keep your wrist loose. No, oh, you keep your wrist loose. Yeah, I need more heat here. Coming up. You gonna temper that steel longer? I don't need to. I triple quenched it with Drago oil. See, how inventive and sanitary. You clever little beaver. Never too late to learn a new trick, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. There. Here it is. Nope. Don't forget this. Oh, 
quit your grinning. It's downright unsettling. <laughs> it's just nice to see you together. But now the rune on your brand looks different. Yeah, price of uh, reforging something what broke. I knew it. You two love each other. Oh, cut it out, Francis. You're gonna get me all weak. I like the new one better. Don't you? We have work to do. No. It's moving. What's moving? It's everything. <laughs> Extraordinary. The whole room is built on some kind of axle. There's chains on both sides. Without those... <clears throat> we can flip the temple. All Do right! You... What now? If you mean to break those chains, I'm afraid you'll need to go see to it personally. Roy, your knife. What have we got? Some sort of travel stone. Let me see. Great are Dumbles at us. That's the Unity Stone. You know it. I wasn't sure it existed. If Tyr possessed this, that explains how he could visit all the realms and other lands to boot. He held this. In the panel in Odin's library. Yes. Yes, that's it. I understand now. It shows Tyr walking the realm between realms. You know how you must never stray from the path. Well, Tyr always followed his own path, if you catch my meaning. The realm between realms. Now Tyr's travel room can take us to Jotunheim. How did Tyr do this? Odin suspected the giant secretly possessed some remnant of primordial Jotnar creative essence, the stuff all realms are made of. The Unity Stone must have been fashioned from that essence. It might still be in his stomach. Um, and he's open to letting you go into his mouth to look inside. Ew. Really? By the by, he's not wild about it either. <sighs> yep, that's an eye. Maybe you should stick that in my head for safekeeping. Gently now, gently. Thank you, brother. You don't miss depth until it's gone.
So how do we get back out? We say go. Hold on. What's going on? Well, that was mildly terrifying. Maybe our presence is upsetting Jormungandr's belly. No. Something is wrong. What's happening to him? Nothing good. Glad that's over. Is he getting hit? What is that? We must hurry. Couldn't agree more, brother. this what happened to him something we did no something else a dead giant why would the serpent leave us here look Trust her. Right? Until we know for certain. Keep her distance. The world serpent. What's happened here? We hoped you would know. You are far from home. I'm looking for my son. The two of you. You helped me see things more clearly. You do not know where he is then? No. But the woods and fields speak his name. I know he walks here in Midgard. When did you see him last? Long ago. Before you were even born. Why are you standing so far from me? What's wrong? Something's happened. A feeling that hurting the big snake would bring the two of you out in the open. Do you have any idea, any idea at all, what you have cost me? My boy. Mother. I'm here. Don't run away. Oh, I'm not going anywhere, Mother. I know that you're still angry. I know that how you feel hasn't changed, but I, I want you... How, how I feel? How I feel? I've spent the last 100 years dreaming of this moment. I've rehearsed everything I ever wanted to say to you, every word, to make you understand exactly what you stole from me. But now, I realize I don't need you to understand anything. I don't need you at all. Back off, Kratos. This has nothing to do. This path you walk. Vengeance. You will find no peace. I know. You... I'll deal with you later. But family first. This again? I said stop! Rough! 
You might want to turn away, boy. This won't be pretty. I won't let you hurt him. No, boy. Fine. Stop! No! No! Atreus! You're bleeding. Breathe, boy. Breathe! Not my blood. <clears throat> What is that? <laughs> I can feel this. <sighs> oh, I can feel everything. <laughs> Vulnerable now? Strap, yes. Mistletoe harmed him. Freya said it was wicked. He's more than harmed. The spell is broken. He can be killed. I'm certain of it. It's all coming back now. Now he remembers. She's controlling that thing? Stay out of it! I can reason with him! No, woman! You cannot! He means to kill you! You can't stop me! No one can! Where is he? I don't care if he kills me! I will protect him! I will not let him die! Don't touch it! This will all be over soon! I feel! I feel! Freezing! Stop hurting my boy! Even the all 
father himself could not. I've never felt more alive. Ironic, oh, isn't it? What? Stop interfering in my life! I was just trying to protect you! I wa- <sighs> I've made mistakes, I know. But you're free now. You have what you want. Try to find forgiveness, we can build something new. <laughs> But if that alone will make you whole, if seeing me dead will make things right, I won't stop. No, 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 my boy! My 
dear sweet boy! Freya. He chose this. I will rain down every agony, every violation imaginable upon you. I will parade your cold body from every corner of every realm and feed your soul to the vilest filth in hell that is my promise! He saved your life! He robbed me of everything! Everything. You were just an animal. Passing on your cruelty and rage, you will never change. And you do not know me. I know enough. Does he? Boy, listen close. I'm from a land called Sparta. I made a deal with a god that cost me my soul. I killed many who were deserving. And many who were not. I killed my father. That was your father in hell. Is this what it is to be a god? Is this how it always ends? Sons killing their mothers? Their fathers? No. We will be the gods we choose to be. Not those who have been. Who I was is not who you be. We must be better. Well, guess we are the bad guys now. In her eyes, yes. But she could never make that choice. Hmm. We should finish this journey while I still have strength. I hope this doesn't cause you to explode or anything. Oh, haven't considered that. Maybe we should talk about this a bit more. Nah, I'm sure you'll be fine. Ready? Oh, that's unpleasant! Now, boy! A word, please, before we continue. Listen, the last thing you two need up there is a decomposing heat ruin in the moment. Why not I wait for you here? This is between you and the boy. True. But if someone were to fight... My lady sifts soft, perfect sloshers. You done did it. Sorry. We had to see this. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Uh, 
Fine, damn it. Fine. Watch the head till we return. I can do this. No, no, I can't. Oh. Okay. Ready. Come. Look! We're on the giant's fingers. I can see the highest peak ahead. Right over there. We did it. We did. What are you doing? I have nothing more to hide. Can we go now? We're so close. Boy. happening. It's your axe. It's Muller. Look. She's arguing with a bunch of giants. She... New giants? That's us. The first time we met the world serpent. But how? And our fight with Balder. But that just happened. Wait. They knew everything that was going to happen. The dragon in the mountain, the stone mason, all these drawings. This is our story. No. This is your story. But what does it all mean? That I was not the only parent with secrets. She was a giant. I'm a giant. Why didn't she tell us? She sent us here knowing we would find this. But why not just tell us the truth? Her mother would have had good reasons. Balder was never sent to find me. He was tracking her all along, not knowing she was only ashes. If she had a plan for us, I trust it. Whatever it is. Besides, she hasn't been wrong yet. Come on. We're so close to the end now. Yes. Yes, we are.
father? No. We do it together. Son. There's nothing for us here. Come. So, I get that mother was a giant, which makes me part giant and part god. And part mortal. Right. I guess there's just one thing I don't understand. My name on the wall. Giants called me... Loki? Loki? That's the name your mother wanted for you when you were born. She must have called you that to her people. But why? A question for another day. Let us go home. This year? Is this what she wanted us to see? Did she want us to tell the people or keep it a secret? I do not know. So what should we do? I trust you to decide that. Oh. So why do you want to name me Atreus? I know it can't be for a god. <laughs> no. He was a soldier, a Spartan. A great warrior? All Spartans are great warriors. We trained from birth. Our lives were discipline, duty, battle, and death. Life was grim, and we greeted it grimly. Hmm. But Atreus of Sparta was unlike the rest of us. He wore a smile even in the worst of times. He was happy. He inspired us to hope that though we were machines of war, yet there was humanity in us, goodness. When the day came for him to lay down his life in battle, his sacrifice saved countless others and turned the tide in our favor. Lads, am I glad to see you. I believe I've reached my limit for dwarven charm. What happened, Lemire? They took an uncomfortable number of measurements and then proceeded to bicker about the weather. Where do you want us to take you? How about the warm confines of anywhere bloody else? Time to rest. I'm gonna sleep through winter. Okay, this'll do. Sleep. Way ahead of you.
Atreus, are you ready? Yeah, but I had the weirdest dream. Fimba winter was ending, and Thor came for us, here at the house. It was only a dream.